Okay, hey guys. So, I uh, haven't really had much of a chance to do much with the video today. Took us a minute to get out here, but we are on the property again. And we've got our cabin area marked out. We use sticks to start with. And it's a fairly, fairly big area. It'll be just right for, the, for me and Scott. And, uh, we took and lined rocks up along this side. We're gonna, I'm gonna do that around the rest of it, but we don't really have time to do that today. We're also planting our uh, fruit trees. Got two of them in the ground there. And we figured out, here's this side of the cabin. The doorway is going to be down there. There's definitely lots of rocks up here. But we do need a truck. We figured that out. We're going to pull together and get a, get a truck here within a few weeks. So Along the line, it goes all the way. It goes down quite a ways. But over here... Over in there is where the stream is at. I'll take take this down and show you guys that real quick. I said I was going to do that last time. Ah. There's a bunch of bushes. Berry bushes. One of the berry bushes. That are very thorny. Ouch. The stream is down here. Ouch. Yeah, the little stream is down here. There's not a lot in it right now. There actually ends up being more in it, like down that way. See, there's where part of the stream area is at. Well, you actually get more of the water if you go down the road and it goes down that way. So, it's pretty steep, as you guys can see that. What I'll probably do is I'll pause the video so I can finish working on the trees. A friend of ours is uh, digging the holes for us. But we figured over in here we're going to park the camper trailer to where we've got the area behind here to add on and actually make that a cabin. And then the front area will build the deck on it. And back here, it's going to be kind of, probably a little smaller than what I figured, but the outdoor kitchen, I'm going to do probably like near the cabin. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it down through there. It just depends. Because it does need to be near the garden, but. So if I do it down there, it's going to be right down in that area. Because this corner of the cabin is here. Or I could put the pool up there and then just put the outdoor. Yeah, I'll do that. We'll put the outdoor kitchen probably like right in that area where those pine trees are at. Right there. From like right there. Coop area is going to be back there. Garden area down in that, in that area. And then this is going to be the drive area. Which we're going to have to figure that out. Because it, it's a lot steeper than I thought it was. But it's okay. Anyway. I haven't really quite figured out the barn area. I did figure out the coop area. And the area behind where they'll be able to free range. It'll be fenced in still. But. Give me a second guys. And I will be back. Okay, sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, the camper trailer is going to be in this area with this this spot behind it to add on. And then I'll build the uh, porch around the front of it out this way. And we'll have the drives kind of up this way somehow. We'll have to clear out these pine trees. Andrew's out there exploring. And then 
And I kind of have it pretty much figured out. The orchard area is like, like way back in there. We don't have time to work on trying to clean it out. So we're just planting them up kind of behind the cabin right now. So, but we do at least have the cabin area figured out, which is a good thing. It's, it's actually going to be fairly big. So. Door probably like right in, in this area. Yeah. And then the kitchen on that side. Like right over here. I mean it's going to be kind of small. Kitchen. Open kitchen. It's going to be completely open. And then, like, the pantry area behind it. And a little laundry area back here. And our clothesline is going to be... I'm going to put that, like, through this area. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so we got that figured out. We had to move a... Rethink a couple of our spots for trees. So that's what I'm wondering on the orchard. We might end up having to just kind of do the orchard kind of sparse and kind of around the property because there's a lot of rocks up here. But, I mean, it's a mountain, so, yeah. Anyway, just woods through here. I can come back here and I didn't do this the last time we were here. Because we were with Billy and Lisa. But. It actually looks like this is going to be the perfect spot for like the trail part of a trail right through here. Pine trees. Just all woodsy out here. It's gorgeous out here. I can't wait until we can actually stay out here. <sighs> yeah. This is it, guys. We have lots of trees to use for lumber for the cabin. I'm going to have pallets brought up here. Look at these flowers. Aren't these gorgeous? Look at that. Look at that, you guys. Absolutely gorgeous. When we come out here and we have more time, I'm going to try to make some time for kind of exploring through the woods and that kind of thing. But, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this and just absolutely gorgeous out here. I love it. Cannot wait to be able to be out here. Like on a daily basis especially. It's going to be so awesome. Lots of brush to be able to use for kindling and that kind of thing. Once we do get out here. Ugh. I'm gonna put sticks and crap in my hair. Yeah, look at that. It's absolutely gorgeous out here. But Leanne figured out where she wants her little spot. She wants hers on the corner near the road, which is fine. We have a ton of pine needles. This will make great compost stuff to add to the compost. A lot of rocks out here to use. A lot of wood we can use for burning and that kind of thing. And then logs for our house. So, yeah. Looks like it's going to work. It's going to be pretty awesome. We just got to figure out the vehicle situation because that's, that's kind of an issue. <laughs> just a little bit. That's kind of an issue. But. Uh, I don't know. 
one of the berry bushes are out here, except for the blueberry, or the blueberries, the blackberry, but I have no idea what those are. Those are really pretty, though. But I just want to give you guys a little bit more of a tour than last time, and show you guys a little bit that we're getting done, and ew. Gross spider webs. I know, I hate spiders. But anyway, yeah, it's pretty it's pretty nice out here. It's more than pretty nice. It's awesome out here. I love it. Just trying to figure out the same way I came. <sighs> yeah. Anyway, so I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, close out this video, and I'll upload this tonight, and or when we get back. So you guys see how gorgeous it is out here. It's so beautiful out here. But, yeah, well. Sorry, I'm trying to get branches out of my way so I can get back. Anyway, ew. Gross. So, I'm going to go ahead and get off from here. And I will see you guys on the next video. And you guys all let me know what you think. And you guys have a good day. Bye, guys.